What's going on guys, Chris Rennick here, and today we are taking the beast out. GTR, two wiring specialties, because like I don't really like the way I fixed that little wiring job, and I think I'm just gonna get a new pigtail, because really what happened was, I'll show the picture right here. The wire split so close to the end of the pigtail that I really didn't have much room to work with. I don't really feel comfortable with that. I don't really think it's a reliable way of keep driving this car. So I'm just gonna do a wiring specialties. I'm sure they'll have that plug and everything. And then I'll actually have more of a wire to work with and then we can actually clean it up. So I wanna do that before we do anything today. Today is Monday. So as long as Anton is ready, I am ready to help him with the Turbo Miata. As long as everything goes smooth, I need to drive an hour away to get to wiring specialties. So hopefully this thing doesn't break. I don't think it will though, I think we're good. All right, so I just got the wiring specialties. Earl hooked it up. Big shout out to wiring specialties and Earl literally got here. Earl came out with a new connector and kind of just put it all back together the right way instead of using butt connectors and all that stuff. So now I just have one whole solid wire instead of like snipping it and then having a butt connector in between. So hopefully I will never have to worry about that again. Thanks guys. Fast forwarding a few hours, we got Mr. Hard R and the kid. Mr. Hard R and the kids coming. Dude, I walked in. Yeah. She got so happy. She was crying. I was. I kissed her goodbye, dude. Tears. So she's coming. She's coming. She's coming I for can't the ride. Leave her behind. Dude. <laughs> Sounds good, man. Throw her in. I'm going. <laughs> All right, guys. So another hour later, we are at Anton's. I guess could we call this Anton's garage? I guess for now. <laughs> So we got the red Miata in here. We got to get this thing out of here. Yeah, no, that's the first thing. The, the red one's easy to get in now. I'm not going to lie to you, dude. This is not a bad setup. We're going to take the hood off. We're going to have a light right there. This will be in and out in, I'm going to say, four days. Because what do you want to do Saturday? I want to drift. Hell yeah. Where? Lock City. Don't run out because we definitely need to drift the Turbo Miata there. Yeah, I would love to. That's going to be your first drift event My first in a Turbo event. Miata. We should bring both. I'm definitely. I'm not. I don't know if I should drift the stock Miata. Throw it down in the comments if we should bring both or if we can even get this Turbo Miata one done. I'm pretty confident we can get it done in three days. Hey, but what didn't you get? Tell tell the world because I said, are you going to have everything on Monday? I didn't get the gasket kit. Yeah, no gasket kit, but it's okay. But we're not doing that today. Yeah, no, it's all right because the goal is get the engine out, put it on the stand, and then we're good. And then we have to do a bunch of dirty work tomorrow, which we'll talk about tomorrow. But let's stop wasting time. We're going to get this thing out and get the white Miata in. Let's hit it. So Anton's beached right now. What are you just gonna wing it? Oh my. <laughs> Low life, dude. Carbon monoxide, coming right up. <laughs> the hell was that? I don't wanna know. Anton gives no fucks. I wish I filmed what he just did. Cause it was not pretty. We need to move that snowblower out. I mean, you can tell if it's fresh or not. You're not very even, guy. That's right. We don't need the side. Um, we got to jack it up on all fours. Just go in the middle. It takes... <laughs> great. Anton's already getting mad. It's going to be a great night. That's fine. You're good there. Oh, you like this? I like it. All right, so step number one, let's get this hood out so we can actually see what we're doing. all my wheels. You didn't curb all of them. <laughs> You're like half smiling, half pumped. <laughs> I told you to chill, dude. Whatever, dude. Really Literally, I was trying to guide him, and then he just was just speeding. I wish you filmed it, cause then yeah, he crashed into the Volvo. <laughs> Did I dent it or anything? No, it's just Good a little. You, you can you can buff it out. <laughs> but I guess she's in here. I mean, it wasn't pretty, but yeah. she's in here. Let's get this hood off. Okay, so tonight I'm half supervisor, half worker. We got half of this under tray off, and I take it, Anton. You're never gonna use that again. No, fuck it. We got a um, strip nut. What are you gonna do about it? Cut it. You're gonna cut it. Yep. <laughs> All right. So as Anton's doing that, I, um, uh, I got Santa's workers over there because they owe me money. Yeah, Santa's workers over here. He's gonna take the shifter out of it. He already got the center console out. We're gonna pop that off and. Anton is already cutting two minutes into this operation and what? he's cutting with an angle grinder. What, dude? <laughs> Whatever, dude. I could have used a hammer. Have fun. <laughs> two tools, hammer and an angle grinder. That's it, dude. Throw down in the comments if you guys think we're going to get this done before Lock City. Lock City is this Saturday. It's currently Monday. I think Saturday is the 19th. I don't know what the date is today. 14th? It's the 14th today. We're going there on the 19th, hopefully. And we also still need a tune, so. Did you get it? Yeah, I'm gonna rip it down now. Let's see it. Yeah, dude, rip her. Come on. I gotta cut more, dude. You gotta cut. <laughs> I love how you're cutting to get the fucking trail. 
I hate him and love him. Look, he's looking at me, dude. Oh no, my tire! <laughs> Oh my god. First time. And she's out. Where does this go? In the garbage. We're in a dumpster. Hell yeah. Alright, so Anton went cutting for this. You don't even have to do that. I'm gonna. Oh, you're taking the lower reading? I hate you, dude. Dude, fuck that. I thought you were taking the center off. No. So he's supposed to take that off. I don't know if you can see it, and but I guess you stripped it. Good old plastic parts, dude. Oh, dude, the Duke Brown. All right, you ready for this? <laughs> You're an asshole. Why, dude? You should have warned me. I said, are you ready for this? Yeah. <laughs> dude, look at the Duke Brown. That's what my shit looks like when I shit. <laughs> I saw it in the camper when I shit in my driver. <laughs> oh, dude, that was disgusting. Ooh, it smells like my shit, too. All right, I gotta cut. I gotta go. All right, so the radiator's out after how long? 25 minutes. 25, at least you're honest with it, honestly. <laughs> I was, There's I expected you to say on. like 30 seconds. There is a lot going on. There's about 20 people here. There's I've had two. About 15 different people come and go in the last 10 seconds. <laughs> There's two 500 pound dogs right dude, there. Don't talk shit about my dogs now. They're huge, dude. They that huge. thing will kill me. Literally. But anyways, I She's want to see you pull this too. up. Why would you train a dog to be deadly when you have a kid? Deadly to you. Oh, thanks, man. But the radiator's out. I've been kind of just picking away at the wiring. We got someone underneath the car. I don't know his name. Ty. Ty got, Mayo. Yeah, we got we got Ty t taking off the um, eye beam. I don't know what that actually is called, Ty. but Ty's the only one that has shown up. That <laughs> and, has helped. Yeah, that's work, and everyone else is sitting around like this schmuck. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, um, we're doing it. We got the wiring harness off. I'm gonna make someone take off the header because that's gonna suck. They're all gonna be rusty. Is that gonna be you? No. It's gonna be someone. It's not gonna be me. It's gonna. <laughs> okay, so Ty's under the car right now, and we found a problem. Go ahead, Fister. Dude. So your fist is under the in the carpet. Oh yeah. So there's a giant hole under there. Yep. Holy fuck, I can't wait to show yeah, Anton yeah. that. Weight reduction. Yeah. <laughs> well, come here. Dude, he's fisting. What? Look, look. You ready to Flimstone, dude? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone out of gas, you're good, though. Dude, maybe you're just so low, you just scraped the floor out. Honestly, I may have no, tried no, to get in here. Everything else is scraped, but the hole. How rusty is it under there? It's pretty crusty. <laughs> it's pretty crusty. Well, we knew that. That's why I said we're gonna turbo this, we're gonna make it fresh, and then when you're ready to be a big boy, we'll do a nice shell. Yeah. But this shell is fine until it falls apart and you flintstone it, that'd be sick. So I never met Ty a day in my life, but that's him, this dude's killing it. He's doing everything underneath. He's do he's taking the um, tranny bolts out, he's cutting the exhaust. Let's, he just say, let's just say he's new. He's new. He doesn't know what to get in for you. <laughs> <laughs> we got Schmucky in there taking the fuel pump out for tomorrow when we actually get a wall, bro. We're killing it. We should call him Schmucky. Schmucky. Yo, Schmucky. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I mean, this thing's about to come out. This cruise control that never worked can come out. And I mean, too? yeah, I couldn't get it. Yeah. I, this thing could be out in probably half an hour. Good time. <laughs> You're an idiot. Cruise control. Jump. Thank you, Mega Squirt. If anyone needs this, hit up Anton. He'll give it to you for free because it's what? No. going in the dumpster. Mega Squirt, dude. Yeah, but get rid of the map. Parts, dude. You will never need that again. What if I buy another map that needs one? No, oh, you got a dumpster dive then. What if the red one needs it? <laughs> you got a good dumpster dive, dude. Fuck me. <laughs> Intake air tube that probably never did nothing. Junk. Anton, what's happening right now? We have a sludge. Oh! oh! <laughs> so we didn't take the dry shaft out because it was probably too rusty. So we just took a sledgehammer. To... We, didn't, we didn't hit it like I wanted. But... No. <laughs> <laughs> we still ended up using a big hammer though. Always saves us. Hey, can you get that clip now? For the wiring harness so we don't destroy that? This thing is gross, dude. We're going to have to buy a lot of brake clean tomorrow. You're buying a lot of brake clean. Yeah, right. This ain't my car. <laughs> We got a lot of work to do, dude. You still think we're gonna make it to Lock City? I want to. No, we'll, we'll make it. I hope. Right. I, I'm gonna try. Anton's gonna have a full, full time job. He's gonna go to work and then come here and work on this all night. I'm staying at my 
girlfriend's parents house this week with my dogs my cat everything just to do this don't forget about that wiring harness i keep telling you but no one's doing anything about it oh yeah the gas line shit oh. all right now what's happening now we're up. oh tie careful dude <laughs> just keep going up oh everything's falling sunglasses dude. this is the dirtiest miata engine i've ever seen and i've pulled a lot of these things look at the sludge on the transmission Thank God we're regassing this thing. We're not though, that's problem. No, we are. We're not. We are. <laughs> Why wouldn't you? I don't wanna. I like that's it. connected to the chassis. Is that important? This is like me. Yeah, just keep going sludgy actually. And gross, but still runs good. What'd you say? It's like me, sludgy and gross, but still runs good. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. How does it feel now that your Miata isn't running? I have another. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so I think that's it. I mean, I, I wanted to get it on the stand, but I f kind of forgot they had to take the transmission off. You got to take the clutch off. We got to do all that shit. Yeah. But it's cool to look at. So I guess what we're going to do now is we're going to take the jack stands off. We're going to push the Miata all the way in the back, and we're going to lay the engine on the floor and kind of just stare at it for a second and say, ooh, ah, ready? Ooh, ah. All right, guys, so three hours later, start to finish, we have the engine on the stand. Now, looking at this thing, it's a much bigger project than we were anticipating. Well, I guess then you were anticipating because I'm telling you all these things. And you're like, dude, I just want to slap a turbo on and run. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> but I, what I am suggesting is we sand the block down a little bit. We paint it. We do all the gaskets. We do the timing belt. We do the water pump. We make all of the gaskets nice, dude. new, so we don't have to worry about what it. What you're describing is not going to get me drifting on Saturday. It will if we no. just work at it. Yeah, work at it. Dude, I got to be at work in four hours. <laughs> Okay, that's an exaggeration. Mm, but literally, because really, he goes to work the same time I do. <laughs> I gotta be up early. I can't be doing this every night. This is a late night for me. Yeah, so it's nine thirty right now. Anton shot, but good news is we did what we wanted to do. We actually did more because we just wanted the engine out. We actually got it on the stand and everything. Yeah. So. Yeah, and we got the fuel pump out. Everything is ready. Um, I think tomorrow we're really going to work on cleaning the engine bay, taking this thing all apart. I really do think we should do the time belt and water pump at the very least. Front and rear, of course. I'll think about it. <laughs> Let no, me know what you guys think down in the comments. Gonna, I'm probably just going to end up buying a whole gas kit. <laughs> <laughs> you don't seem too stoked about it. I mean, I'd be down to do this while you're at work, honestly. Garage is open. I guess we'll have to see, but let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Um, what do you guys think we should do to this thing? We're definitely going to get rid of the AC condenser. I want to get the power steering working because it's it's easy. You you said you don't care about it, but once this I mean, has power steering... This doesn't have it. The red one doesn't have it. My redneck Miata didn't have it. I don't know what power steering in a Miata is. When I first had the Ricer Miata, it never had power steering. Ever since I had the Roadster, it always had power steering. I will never go back to no power steering, ever. It was amazing. But anyways, guys, if you guys like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you guys want to subscribe for more, subscribe for more. Everyone is tired, including me, because I go to bed at like 10 now. I've been waking up at 8. It's been great, but I'm shot, so I'll see you later.